Hey, okay. <laughs> I love this. Hi, guys. My name is Christina Sarcom. I am based out of New York City, and I am a fine artist. I just take, like, a pencil, um, lead pencil, and, like, sketch out the big areas. High key, you're not supposed <laughs> to do this with, like, oil paint or acrylics from whatever, because it could blend into the paint. But that's okay, because, you know, we just live in our life, right? And you know what? Honestly, like, when you draw the... The whole point of it is to, like, of course, you know, be intentional, but for this piece, since it's just demonstration to show you guys, like, you know, it doesn't have to be super accurate to your reference, and that's okay, you know, it's art, it's, it's what you make it, you know what I mean? Guys, I'm just painting the darker areas first. It's really all about just blocking in, honestly. Christina, when did you, like, start getting into art and, like, kind of start getting more, like, like, when did it for you turn from being a hobby to, like, okay, I want to pursue this as my career? Honestly, like, I was just going to school for, like, computer science, and not that there's anything wrong with that, but it was more so of, like, I was realizing that I was just pursuing professions that, you know, like, my parents wanted me to do or, like, just in general, like, other people. And mm -hmm. I was always, like, into art, but I had this fear of, like, well, I'm going to be an artist and literally, like, not make any money. Um, not that it's about money, but, you know, like, you want it to be a, a sustainable career. Like, you don't want to, like, live on the street. You know what I mean? Exactly. Um, so, for me, like, I just wanted to make it a, a business so I I started this pretty Hi, recently Diana. and it was just you know something that just like always spoke to me like I've always always done it my entire life you know I feel like they have all those adult coloring books for a reason and it's like take you know, a minute like, I guess like check out literally there's art therapy like this is an actual legitimate thing because I looked yeah. it up and I was like Loki I want to be an art therapist because I'm oh, yeah. be making like two hundred thousand dollars a year, and I'm like, oh, six figures. Yes, but um, the rich kids. So right. Well, I mean, we trying to get seven, eight, nine figures out here. Feel me, but yeah, I, this is so embarrassing. Um, I don't know painters. I'm so glorious. I mean, I, I know there's Bas oh my god, Bas I think Bas Pot? Ba Basquiat. Yo, he's yeah. literally like. <laughs> see, he's another one. I really enjoy his stuff, but um. Damn, he, he's also, like, part of the 27 Club, and it's, like, I really like his ideology, but it's, like, why all my favorite artists have to die at 27? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's all about the, the tape rip. I don't know about you guys, but it's just so, like, it's a sign that everything is just done. Um, I'm also low-key getting oil paint on my fingers, so. So it's cool because... From far away, you know, it's Johnny. Like, oh, it's like, damn, who is that, right? You know, like, damn, like she really did that. But then, you know, you come up close and you see the brush strokes. You know what I mean? Oh and that's, wow! And that's I one mean. thing, like, I learned about, like, I guess, like, realism. Well, this is not like super realistic. Cause I only have like forty-five minutes to do this. But right. you know, you back up at a certain distance, like you see, like your eyes complete the image because it's an optical illusion and that's literally art like so people who say oh I'm not good at art I don't like to draw like literally it's all about like how Texture. you can make something 3d on a 2d space that's it like it's really like optical illusion because our eyes like we think we see things in a certain way but in reality it's like completely different shout out to Erica. Really, shout out to the whole team <laughs> love it okay